Okay, in this video, it's going to be power testing um, the HDP Compact. And this one, the first test is going to be with CO2. And I got just a typical Umarex rubber balls in there. Not sure if you can see them. But, um, yeah, first test is going to be with CO2. And, uh, okay, these are just a little eight grammers. Um, all right, so just crack this. Now we're gassed. Uh, we're also going to do an HPA test too. It's 1100 and 850 HPA. Okay, so here goes first shot. That was 464 with rubber balls. 448. That was an air. Four thirty-one, and how many shots have we got left? Now we're empty. One, two, three. So we get seven shots of that. All right, I'll just take the CO two. I'm gonna convert it over to HPA now. Get the rest of that air out. CO2 thing. Alright, just connecting the HPA now. Just a bottle in adapter. Not the airline. Okay, we'll start here with the 850 PSI first. Just screwing it into the bottle here. Alrighty, now I'm going to put some steel bearings in. I believe these are the smaller bearings, so these are going to be a little smaller in diameter. 8.4 grammers or have more slightly bigger in diameter, so they're better for the factory barrels than these Umarex markers. But, yeah, I'm going to stick four of these bearings in and test there with the 850. I might just shoot a couple with 850 and a couple with 1100. <clears throat> okay, sludge, where is my ASA, now we're gassed, see we got the bottle in, connected like this, I'm not at home but I'm still able to make this video here down in a friend's basement, okay, shot one, steel ball bearings, HTP compact. Oh, that didn't raise her, did it? 431. Oh, why is my chronograph not reading these? Damn it. Hold on, let me reset it here. Doesn't like that orange light. I just bought this. But let's try again. Oh, it got one. Only 179. Oh. Yeah, it's four shots. <clears throat> try one more here. Two oh seven, eight fifty HPA. Okay, slide check. Turn this off. <clears throat> I'll try the eleven hundred PSI bottle now. Yeah, 
Yeah, that little bear. It's only like a three. I don't even know. It's three, maybe four inches. No, I don't even think it's four inches. And these are the smaller bearings, too. So, uh, the bigger bearings will fit the barrel better. Steel bearings loaded, 1100 PSI. <laughs> See what happens. Okay, shot one. Two thirty eight. Didn't read that one, and my eardrums are half blown. <clears throat> Two thirty-seven. Do we have one more in here? Another error. Okay, degassing. <clears throat> Anyways, um, actually, uh, actually, I kind of want to try this dart. <clears throat> I've got one of these darts here. I think it's. I'll have to wait, but I have them. I have it marked down somewhere. But we'll see what this does. <laughs> okay, we're gassed up here, and I'm gonna shoot that dart. Ready, three, two, one. Woo! There it is. I'll get the results and I'll write them down for you. Or you guys can always do it yourself. Uh, um, they're 8 gram steel bearings and I don't know, 1 point something gram rubber balls. And I'll get the results and I'll put it in the description. But yeah, guys, have a good one. At least we know this didn't blow on the first shot if it's 1100 or 850. So yeah, I'm going to put a longer barrel in and retest it. But. Yeah, take care, guys.